dear students today we are continue the problems of limits right see question number 11 limit x tending to 0 logarithm of 1 plus x cube divided by sin cube x what is the formula related to logarithm the formula related to logarithm is limit x tending to 0 limit x tending to 0 logarithm of 1 plus x logarithm of 1 plus x divided by x logarithm of 1 plus x divided by x is equal to 1 this is the formula related to the logarithm right now how to calculate the limit value of the given function right that is equal to limit x tending to 0 limit x tending to 0 logarithm of 1 plus x cube here divide numerator and denominator by x cube divide numerator and denominator by x cube sin cube x divided by x cube now applying the above formula limit y tending to 0 logarithm of 1 plus y divided by y that is equal to 1 in denominator also limit x tending to 0 sin cube x divided by x cube that is also equal to 1 so that 1 by 1 that is equal to 1 that is the limit value of the given problem right now see question number 12 compute or calculate limit x tending to 0 x tan to x minus 2x tan x divided by 1 minus cos 2x whole square right see this how to calculate this limit value if we substitute the limit value the given function is of the form 0 by 0 that is indeterminate form right how to calculate the limit value of this function right that is equal to limit x tending to 0 limit x tending to 0 x into tan 2x what is the formula for the tan 2x tan 2x is 2 tan x divided by 2 tan x divided by 1 minus tan square x 2 tan x by 1 minus tan square x minus 2x tan x minus 2x tan x divided by divided by 1 minus cos 2x 1 minus cos 2x that is 2 sin square x 2 sin square x whole square right that is equal to limit x tending to 0 limit x tending to 0 see the numerator 2x tan x is common take 2x tan x as common in the numerator 2x into tan x take 2x into tan x as common in the numerator now we have 1 by 1 minus tan square x 1 by 1 minus tan square x minus 1 divided by 2 square 2 square is 4 sin square x whole square that is uh, sin power 4x right that is equal to here two ones two twos are gets cancel 1 by 2 is a constant so right 1 by 2 limit x tending to 0 limit x tending to 0 x into tan x x into tan x take lcm 1 minus 1 plus tan square x 
divided by 1 minus tan square x divided by 1 minus tan square x whole divided by sin power 4x whole divided by sin power 4x right here 1 1 gets cancelled that is equal to 1 by 2 into limit x tending to 0 1 by 2 into limit x tending to 0 x into tan cube x x into tan cube x divided by sin cube x sorry sin power 4x into limit x tending to 0 1 by 1 minus tan square x 1 by 1 minus tan square x right observe this function observe this function right divide numerator and denominator by x power 4 divide numerator and denominator by x power 4 that is equal to 1 by 2 into limit x tending to 0 x into tan cube x x tan cube x divided by x power 4 divided by sin power 4x divided by sin power 4x divided by x power 4 into by applying the limit to this function that is equal to 1 right here x x gets cancelled now this is uh, x cube tan cube x by x cube is equal to 1 similarly sin x whole power 4 divided by x power 4 that is also equal to 1 so that the required limit value that is equal to 1 by 2 right right now this is exercise 8b find the right hand and left hand limits of the function at the point a is equal to 1 right how to find the left hand limit and the <coughs> right hand limit of the given function at the given point right now left hand limit left hand limit simply can be written as LHL LHL is called left hand limit right limit x tending to x tending to here a is equal to 1 x tending to 1 minus limit x tending to 1 minus f of x that is the left hand limit at x is equal to 1 limit x tending to 1 minus x tending to 1 minus means that x less than 1 x tending to 1 minus means x less than 1 what is the corresponding function when x less than 1 that is 1 minus x is a corresponding function when x less than 1 now here no need to write uh, x tending to 1 minus simply limit x tending to 1 now by applying the limit value that is equal to 0 left hand limit is equal to 0 now right hand limit simply RHL right hand limit that is uh, RHL limit x tending to 1 plus limit x tending to 1 plus f of x that is equal to limit x tending to 1 plus x tending to 1 plus it means that x greater than 1 if x greater than 1 what is f of x if x greater than 1 f of x is equal to 1 plus x in this also no need to write x tending to 1 plus simply write x tending to 1 right by applying the limit value we get the limit value is equal to 2 right see what are the what is the value of LHL and RHL those two are equal or not if those two limits are equal 
then the function has limit exists at x is equal to 1 otherwise limit does not exist therefore limit x tending to 1 minus f of x is not equal to limit x tending to 1 plus limit x tending to 1 plus f of x therefore limit x tending to 1 f of x does not exist limit extending to 1 f of x does not exist right since left hand limit not equal to right hand limit right now see another one this is second roman question number one okay here f of x defined a piecewise function if x less than 0, the corresponding image is 1. If x lie between 0 to 1, the corresponding image is 2x plus 1. If x greater than 1, the corresponding function is 3x. Right? Here also verify the, verify the limit exists or not at a is equal to 1. Right? Now consider left hand limit, limit x tending to here also 1 x tending to 1 minus f of x that is equal to limit x tending to 1 minus x tending to 1 minus means x less than 1 x less than 1 the corresponding function is 2x plus 1 right so here x tending to 1 by applying the limit value that is equal to 3 now right hand limit right hand limit limit x tending to 1 plus limit x tending to 1 plus f of x is equal to limit x tending to 1 ok x tending to 1 plus x tending to 1 plus means x greater than 1 x greater than 1 the corresponding function is 3x the corresponding function is 3x now by applying the limit value that is also is equal to 3 therefore limit extending to 1 minus f of x limit extending to 1 minus f of x is equal to limit x tending to 1 plus f of x therefore limit x tending to 1 f of x limit x tending to 1 f of x exists and is equal to 3 limit x tending to 1 f of x exists and is equal to 3 right this is the way to find the left hand limit and right hand limit of a given piecewise function right now let us see next problem question number three show that limit x tending to 2 minus modulus of x minus 2 by x minus 2 is equal to minus 1 here x tending to 2 minus x tending to 2 minus that implies x less than 2 x tending to 2 minus it means that x less than 2 that implies x minus 2 less than 0 x minus 2 less than 0 if x minus 2 less than 0 that implies modulus of x minus 2 modulus of x minus 2 by the definition of modulus modulus of x minus 2 is equal to minus of x minus 2 since x minus 2 less than 0 right now limit x tending to 2 minus or x minus 2 tends to 0 x minus 2 tends to 0 modulus of x minus 2 modulus of x minus 2 is equal to minus of x minus 2 
minus of x minus 2 divided by x minus 2 x minus 2 x minus 2 gets cancelled that is equal to minus 1 that is the limit value right now let us see question number 4 here x tending to 0 plus x tending to 0 plus it indicates that x greater than 0 x tending to 0 plus it means that x greater than 0 if x greater than 0 that implies mod x is equal to x if x greater than 0 then mod x is equal to x now the limit value limit x tending to 0 limit x tending to 0 2 into x divided by x 2 into x divided by x plus x plus 1 plus x plus 1 right here x x gets cancelled now by applying the limit value we get 2 plus 0 plus 1 that is equal to 3 right that is the limit value right now see this limit compute limit x tending to 2 plus limit x tending to 2 plus box x plus x box x plus x how to find the limit value okay here given that x tending to 2 plus x tending to 2 plus it means that x lie between 2 and 3 it means that x lie between 2 and 3 that implies box x is equal to 2 box x is equal to 2 that is equal to limit x tending to 2 limit x tending to 2 box x is equal to 2 2 plus x now by applying the limit 2 plus 2 2 plus 2 that is equal to 4 right now also find limit extending to 2 minus limit extending to 2 minus box x minus x limit extending to 2 minus box x minus x right ok limit extending to 2 minus box x minus x ok right this is uh, plus x this is uh, plus x right as x tending to 2 minus x tending to 2 minus so x less than 2 x less than 2 and greater than 1 so that box x is equal to 1 box x is equal to 1 right that is equal to limit x tending to 2 limit x tending to 2 1 plus x now by applying the limit that is equal to 1 plus 2 that is equal to 3 right this is the right hand limit and this is the left hand limit here right hand limit not equal to left hand limit right hand limit not equal to left hand limit therefore limit x tending to 2 box x plus x does not exist limit x tending to 2 box x plus x does not exist let us see next one define f mapping from closed interval minus 1 by 2 comma infinity to real number set defined by f of x is equal to square root of 1 plus 2x where x belong to closed interval minus 1 by 2 comma infinity then compute right hand limit at x is equal to minus 1 by 2 of f of x hence find limit extending to minus 1 by 2 f of x right see the problem very carefully this is a different problem okay 
from there this is different from previous problems see what is the domain of this function what is the domain of this function minus 1 by 2 comma infinity this is the domain of the function so at x is equal to minus 1 by 2 only right hand limit exists only right hand limit will be defined okay right left hand limit not defined in this domain the domain is minus 1 by 2 comma infinity at x equal to minus 1 by 2 only right hand limit will be defined right okay here compute limit x tending to minus 1 by 2 plus f of x right as x tending to minus 1 by 2 plus x tending to minus 1 by 2 plus it means that x greater than minus 1 by 2 it means that x greater than minus 1 by 2 that implies 2x greater than minus 1 that implies 2x plus 1 greater than 0 that implies it means that 2x plus 1 tending to 0 plus 2x plus 1 tending to 0 plus right now the given limit can be changed to limit 2x plus 1 tending to 0 plus limit 2x plus 1 tending to 0 plus square root of 2x plus 1 by applying the limit value right hand limit at x equal to minus 1 by 2 is equal to 0 hence find limit extending to minus 1 by 2 f of x actually we have to find left hand limit and right hand limit at x is equal to minus 1 by 2 but here consider the domain only right hand limit exists at x equal to minus 1 by 2 the right hand limit at x equal to minus 1 by 2 is equal to 0 hence limit x tending to minus 1 by 2 limit x tending to minus 1 by 2 f of x is equal to limit x tending to minus 1 by 2 plus limit extending to minus 1 by 2 plus f of x right okay that is equal to the right hand limit at x equal to minus 1 by 2 is 0 right so the so that the limit is equal to 0 okay right this is the limit value at x is equal to minus 1 by 2.